Welcome back. In the last lesson, you learned how to leverage the marketplace and some of our core features to build your app. In this lesson, we're going to talk about how to publish your app. Step 1. Create your own Google and Apple developer accounts and enroll in those programs. Both Apple and Google require that you have dedicated developer accounts that you own attached to your app, but there are some benefits that come along in doing so. You'll have more control over your app, your app's listing, and you'll have the ability to access the backend to get to things such as device-specific analytics. If you need help with creating a Google developer account, we have an article and video that takes you through the process which you can access through this link. Creating an Apple developer account is a two-step process. Apple doesn't automatically take you through the enrollment process after you create an Apple ID, so make sure that you enroll in the program as well. Be mindful of what type of Apple developer account you're enrolling in. Apple has two types of Apple developer accounts, the individual account and the company organization account. If your app is branded to your company, then you'll need to enroll in a company organization developer account under your company's name. If your app is branded to you as an individual, then you should enroll in an individual developer account. Enrolling in the correct developer account type helps keep your app and account in line with Apple's guidelines and will help in the submission review process. Due to a requirement by Apple, each Apple developer account needs to have two-factor authentication enabled. This means that you'll need to set up a device for Apple to send a six-digit code to. It's easiest if you have an Apple device that you can use, but if you don't, simply reach out to Apple and they'll be able to help you set that up. Because of this requirement, when you first submit your app, you'll need to reach out to us at support at buildfire.com. That way, we can get you set up for a call where our publishing team can call you to obtain the code in order to submit your app to Apple for you. Step two, upgrade your subscription. If you want to get the most out of the platform, you'll want to upgrade to one of our paid plans. When you do this, not only will you be able to publish your app, but doing so will also unlock advanced features such as targeted push notifications called on-the-go push, user tagging, and more depending on the plan you go with. Once you've enrolled in the Apple and Google developer programs, you can upgrade to one of our paid plans by clicking the Upgrade or Publish button at the top of the app dashboard. Step 3. Fill out your publishing information. Once you have upgraded to one of our paid plans, the publishing information for your app will be unlocked, allowing you to fill it out and send your app off to our publishing team. After you've sent your app off to our publishing team, make sure you reach out to us at support at buildfire.com so that we can get you set up for a call to complete the Apple submission of your app. Now that you know how to build and publish your app, in our next lesson, we'll talk about how to leverage our advanced features to attract your audience and keep them engaged. Thanks for watching.